and being able to find pauses in the dance, being able to rest, being able to open your mind to other things. But steps is not a very easy thing to do. And when you dance with someone new and if you're a little bit excited and a little bit nervous, there is a big chance you will find yourself just doing a lot. And is it possible to, to hold the horses a little bit? You know, is it possible to... I, I'm imagining uh, find the true self inside. You know, not dancing with the things that you believe is right, but more like dancing with your body. And maybe more than that, not the muscles and the nerves that they, they control your body in the, in the way that you think you should. More like maybe dancing with your bones all the way inside. Bones? And now there is a cortina, no? No, cortinas play between the tandas, not between but, the tangos. But what, what do we what do we do? Like, what do I say? What do I say between? Like, what? Just just relax. It's relax and shut up. Really, between the tangos, you should never miss a good chance to shut up. Do, uh, don't I do anything? Just nothing? Yeah, but then the fourth and the fifth second, this awkward silence may kick in. And, and starting from the six seconds, according to the study, six seconds is the limit. And from the six second on, you start to hear things like, is everything all right? You okay? You know? So coincidentally, in milongas, we do have five to six seconds between tangos. So it's just there for you to have that and it's up to you to make a difference and say, I'm going to stay in the embrace and calm down. One time I danced with this girl and, and at the end of the first song I told her, um, hey, you know, how you doing? How, how's it going? You know, and she said, I am speak no English. So, and then from then on, I didn't know how to... And you don't want to be that person. It's okay to have a few seconds of silence in the embrace and then you move on within the tanda. Now, are we in the second song now? Yes, now we are getting into the second song in the tanda. What would we do? So, hey, my friends, this, these are just suggestions. Obviously, um, maybe you have better ideas. Now we walk into the third song. Things are getting exciting. Things will be just fine. So I don't mean to dramatize anything, but uh, most of the times you will be having a nice dance, nicer and nicer and nicer. So things will just get better and better. But if fourth song, in my opinion, according to this logic we're following, might be the conclusion like a dance, might be the, the verdict. There will be all kinds of people you will dance with, um, all kinds of music that you will dance to, and you will be in all kinds of places. Um, and we know nobody is perfect, no tango song is perfect, no place is perfect, and you are not perfect. But there is such a thing called perfect tanda.